So as you can see, we have a guitar pick and it is a broken guitar pick. So I'm not going to be obviously able to use this for uh, my creations. And so this is the guitar pick that we're going to use to uh, see if we can actually start a fire. So what I'm going to do is, um, so as you can see, the guitar pick is already broken. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to finish breaking it off so that I have a piece that I can use to uh, later ignite and I'm going to use the smaller piece that I'm going to shave off um, some pieces on and uh, we'll see how we can add this to the second piece some wood and see if we can actually start a fire with a celluloid guitar pick okay so guitar pick meat knife Let's see what we can do here. So I'm going to just start shaving off some pieces like this. So just cutting off some shavings here from this guitar pick um, so that we can have a base so that using a ferro rod, see if we can actually get this to start a fire. Uh, so again, trying not to cut my fingers and just trying to get this small piece of guitar pick into these little shavings because uh, obviously the smaller the surface that a fire has to start with um, small pieces like this of celluloid are going to be easier to ignite than if i had a huge huge chunk so i'm just going to keep cutting this piece until I have some beautiful little shavings here, as you see, to, uh, to start with. Okay, so I don't know if you can see, what I did is I wedged a piece of the guitar pick, the larger piece that I had, into this piece of wood. I'm gonna add a few wood shavings, um, so just some small pieces of wood around the guitar pick, just to give it some other um, fuel. And we have the guitar pick um, shavings that we had here. So I'm just going to carefully add those on top so that when we use the uh, ferro rod to try and ignite it, it'll be on top of the uh, wood shavings to see if uh, how that'll work. So this is a ferro rod. Um, so a rod and a piece of metal and what I'm going to do is I'm going to scrape this and see if we can get a spark and get this to catch fire. So let's get this party started. Oops. Getting some... Doesn't seem to be, to be working as well as I thought it would be. So I've moved the, uh, so the first attempt didn't quite work. So I moved the uh, shavings closer to the front to see if I can get the, uh, if, I, if I have more of the shavings of the guitar pick shavings to the front to see if that's gonna work. So having moved that to the front, let's again see if we can get this fire started. Some sparks. So I've got my son here to help me and we're gonna see if we can get this party started. So we're just gonna move this to a little bit of a more stable place because I think it's on the uh, on that grill there it's not working as well um, and just give us somewhere where we've got a little bit of a, of a tighter base and then we're just going to we're just we're going to just pile these a little bit more together and let's get this started oh 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 Oh. So we tried it with the flint rod and now, um, clearly that didn't work. So we're going to see if this is actually celluloid. Let's see if what happens if I try it with a match. So 
So clearly that is lighting on fire. So maybe I just didn't get enough of a spark. Ooh, that is some black. So if I added then some more wood onto this, as you could see, it'd be a really easy way to start a campfire. I could add some wood shavings onto here. So, you know, um, so maybe I'm not the greatest at starting it with a uh, piece of, uh, of a fire rod, but as you can see, um, guitar picks are quite flammable. They do uh, work quite well. And if I were to, again, add some more combustible materials to all of this, um, I would have a really nice little uh, campfire started. So uh, yeah, um, interesting. Didn't quite work how I wanted it to, but uh, we can definitely see that guitar picks are not only useful around a campfire to make some fabulous music, but if you're having a hard time getting that fire started, if you have some patience maybe more than I do with the ferro rod, um, or if you have some handy dandy matches, um, you can get that fire started quite well. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like and share if you did.